back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking into this video. If you are new here, my name is Crystal. I would love for you to subscribe, stick around, join the genuine family, become a gem. Also click the bell notification so that you'll never miss one of my uploads. And if you are a returning subby, hey girl, hey. In today's video, I'm bringing you guys another Lovely Wholesale try-on haul. Now, Lovely Wholesale did reach out to me, so I want to thank them for sponsoring today's video. But, as you guys know, that even though they send me these things, all of the opinions are my own. So, I want to go ahead and get right on into this try-on haul. It's kind of like a casual-ish try-on haul, just real chill, like nothing really fancy. Um, but I do want to go ahead and get into the items that didn't work because I did have a couple of things that um, didn't work. Now, I did go ahead and try on the items that they sent me because I didn't need to let them know what items did and did not work. So, but in case you guys are interested and you find that it works for you, I will still have everything linked down in the description box below for you guys. But let me go ahead and show you guys really quick and I'll probably put a picture or something right here. Um, I'll probably put a picture right here of what the model looked like in the outfits and I picked these out myself and so I had intentions on me wearing them. But since they didn't work, I'm going to go ahead and still show them to you guys. Now the reason that they didn't work is because Lovely Wholesale goes up to a size US 24 which for them is a 5X. So, since your girl right now is not true, true, true size 24, like I can get into some 24s, but I'm really naturally a 26, that's the reason why they didn't fit. And some of the stuff, y'all, you guys know that Lovely Wholesale is a China-based company, so um, their sizing is off from ours. And if you like anything in today's video, they did provide me with a 10% off discount code for you guys so make sure you look down in the description box below for everything so let's go ahead and jump right on in here is the first one it is a really nice one back up for you guys it is a really nice in theory <laughs> um maxi dress y'all can see it's two-toned it has the cheetah print on one side y'all know i love the leopard cheetah print so it's color blocked with the print y'all know i love mixing prints and patterns as well so it has the um leopard print on one side and it's all black on the other side now y'all can see with me holding it up like it's a little bit snug like, if I wanted to make this work, I could. I could just, like, ruche it up in a couple of areas, and it wouldn't be a maxi. It would probably be, like, what I what I have on right now, which I'll get into in a minute. But, yeah, this is the first one. All right, and so here's the next one. You guys, I had such high hopes for this. This is, like, a dress, and you can wear it as a cardigan. But first, let me show y'all the print. Now, I did have the holidays in mind. When I picked this out because I thought this would have been so cute for pictures because it has that red and green and then it has some blues in there. I thought this was really cute for the holidays. Again, y'all see the picture right here of how it's supposed to look. Now, you can wear it two ways. That's the reason why I was drawn to it when I saw it on the uh, website because you can wear it, like I said, as a cardigan coat type thing or you can um wear it as a dress but yeah i when i tried this on i was like it's not going to work because it didn't fit me through the arms you guys see i have bigger arms and then it didn't fit like closing the bust so i was only able to get one button close across my bust and that was it and i really didn't like that it was so super tight around my arms so yeah, I had high hopes for this as well. And it's super duper long. Like, can y'all see? I'm holding it up to my shoulders. And it's basically hitting the floor. Like, dragging the floor. Almost kind of like a train. If I had this on, it would be dragging the floor like a train. Almost. 
and I'm 5A for reference. So, yeah, you guys, this one was a fail. And like I said, I'm not really the one to hold on to stuff just because until I can get in it. Like, I used to be that way, but at this stage in my life, I'm no longer like that. But, yeah, this was a fail. I really like this. Like, I had so much house for it. It's so cute. But it didn't work. <laughs> So yeah, that's that one, you guys. And like I said, everything will be linked down in the description box. I'll probably put these two items first so that you guys can tell which one is which. So let's go ahead and get on to the next thing. I'll go ahead and show you guys what I have on. And so this is basically how I styled it. I have on my little furry, my little cream color fl uh, flurry, furry slippers from uh, Walmart. This is really cute. Like. This is my style. This is exactly how I wear it. You guys see I have my little pearl headband on. That's how I was able to bring in. I love this chocolate color. Like, can y'all see this color? I love this like mocha brown chocolate color. I think it looks really cute on my skin tone. Now, y'all know I'm stepping out of my comfort zone with these body cons because y'all know I was a little apprehensive about the body cons. But this is perfect for me to like to wear around the house. I definitely would wear this around the house. Here's the back. And because of the way the weather has been, I would... You know scrunch it up on my arms a little bit this is how i would wear it and this actually comes with uh this is actually like a tube dress so it's basically like a tube top it doesn't have like any scrunching or smockness up here to keep it up so i have been kind of pulling it up um i would probably wear it with like a bandeau or something not like my regular bra if i would be wearing it around the house So that I won't have to be constantly pulling it up. But yeah, I love the duster that it comes with. Like, this is my vibe all day long. I'm really getting into the two-piece set. So, and to find some for us bigger girls, 24, 26 and up, it's kind of hard to find sets like this for us. So, I'm glad I was able to find this one from Lovely Wholesale. So yeah, this is the first one. Let me know what you guys think. So here's the next outfit, you guys. I really, really hope I'm not giving y'all Pepto-Bismol. But when I saw this two-piece set, I was thinking of these shoes. I have never worn them. These are like the Vapor Max, the like triple pink, hot pink. Vapor Max, and so I thought this was going to go really well with this. So this is a two-piece set. It's the joggers. Well, for me, they're leggings. Now, the only thing I don't like is that they don't come all the way up. Like, here's where they stop. Luckily, the shirt covers it up, and but here's where they stop. Like, here's the top of my butt right here. But it's not too bad. I don't feel exposed or anything like that. Um, but yeah, this is just a two-piece set. It's like a really stretchy material. It feels warm. And yeah, I don't feel like really constricted, like I can't move in it. Um, the only thing is that I feel like if I was to sit down, you know, of course, it might come down some. So I might be tugging and pulling it up ever so often. But am I giving y'all Pepto-Bismol? Let me come closer. <laughs> I hope I'm not. I like this color pink and I think it goes really well with the shoes too. What y'all think? Because the shoe has like, it's hot pink and neon. It's three types of pink. So like the swoosh is one color, the knit is one color, and then like the bottom of the shoe is kind of almost matching the, um, color of the jump the uh, set so what y'all think all right you guys so here's the 
the next outfit. This is also a two-piece set, just like the previous one I just tried on. Only it is in this really nice dark olive green color, army green color, which I absolutely love. And then I just paired it with my um, hiking boots, my chestnut color hiking boots with the faux fur that I hauled from Walmart. I think this would also go really well with some like Ugg boots. The pink one I think will go well with like if you had like some black Ugg boots. I do not own any black Ugg boots, but I wanted that to go with my Vapor Max. So yeah, here is the next outfit. If it's the exact same way, I don't know. Maybe the dark color, it feels a little bit more comfortable than the last one. I'm not exactly sure, but I really like this. I probably would pair it with like a denim jacket or something because it's warm, but if it was like a real, real cold day, I would need something to like go over my arms or I have like my camel jacket. Ooh, yes, honey. Let me see how this look. I didn't even think about my camel. I didn't even think about my camel jacket. Hold on, y'all. I don't know. These greens are deep. These greens are off. So, it may not look right. How does that look? Is it too much green? I can't really tell because the camera is so far away. And then I got these lights, so I can't tell if this go or not. But y'all let me know, or I'll see it once I start editing. <laughs> This is just a dress and I paired it with my uh, Vans. It's a maxi dress. I paired it with my Vans and I had to come back with another headband. This is like my black and white buffalo plaid headband that I picked up from Amazon. But yeah, I paired it with my sneakers just because of what it says. It says today's outfit. Uh, what is that? <laughs> One hour later. So yeah, this is not going to be seen the light of day. <laughs> this is going to be an at home, an at home, like put some slides on. And I didn't even realize, I didn't even realize it, it was a typo. I just, in my mind, I already knew what it said. So I just kept saying today's outfit, oversized t-shirt and sneakers. This... But yeah, okay, we're just going to roll with it. So yeah, this this outfit not going to see the light of day. I'm just going to be chilling around the house. Because <laughs> I don't need y'all talking about me if y'all see me out. But yeah, this in theory was a cute outfit. Um, my boo keep wanting to eat these letters over here. So I wish it would eat eat this letter. <laughs> but yeah, oh. And I thought this is a really cute outfit. I love sneakers with dresses. I'm mad. I'm sad. I'm sad about it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, it's a three-quarter length sleeve. It is tight in the arms a little bit because they have a seam right here. I'm not sure if this is supposed to be up on my shoulder, this little seam right here. But that's, that part is tight on my arms. But... Since I see me just wearing this at home, I would probably cut that off and just wear it around the house. But, house dress. <laughs> oh, I'm so sad about it. So, yeah, this is the last and final look. I had we ended on a bad note. 
you guys, that's going to do it for my lovely wholesale try on haul. Let me know which outfit was you guys' favorite or if it's your style. I know this is kind of like a really, really casual, low-key try on haul um, this go around. So I really appreciate you guys for watching this video. I want to give a big thank you to Lovely Wholesale for sending me these pieces to review for you guys. Don't forget to look down in the description box below for the links to everything and take advantage of that 10% discount call. I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, live your life, sis. Bye, guys.